Welcome to CAT tutorials and in this video we're going to be covering practice problem 2.3. The question says a resistor absorbs an instantaneous power of this much which is 30 core squared milliwatts when it is connected to a voltage source V equals to 15 cos T volt. And you're asked to find the current and the resistor's value. So here are the formulas which we'll be using from Ohm's law, V is equals to I R, and the power formula, which says P is equals to V I. Now, if you can just check what we're given here, you can just simply plug these values in one of the formulas to find any of the variables. So let's start with finding the current. So using this power formula, P is equal to VI, plug in the power, which is that, and not forgetting the, the units. So I'm going to convert this milli into its numerical value or representation which is times 10 to the minus 3 equals to v v given to us as 15 cos t volts so it just stays like that that's the same as multiplying by 10 to the 0 which is multiplying by 1 so 15 cos t and this unknown variable here, which is i. So to find i, we just simply manipulate this or just divide both sides by 15 cos t. So divide both sides by 15 cos t, divide there by 15 cos t, that will cancel out. So we're left with i is equals to calculating this, we can just cancel there have two there and that left with cos t and that stays the same so the answer would be two cos t times 10 to the minus 3 amperes which is the same as two cos t milli amperes and there you have the current now moving on to the second part of the question which asks us to find the resistance so you can either use the power formula like this or just make it much more simpler and use ohm's law right here v is equals to ir so let's just erase that you can try it with that formula and confirm the answer right so using V is equals to IR, we plug in the voltage given to us as 15 cos T volts is equals to I, I which we just calculated now, 2 cos uh, T times 10 to the minus 3. And the variable which we're looking for is R right here. So dividing both sides by 2 cos T, to have only R on this side, then divide this side as well. 2 cos T times 10 to the minus 3. Now that cancels out, that cancels out, and we're left with R is equals to doing this. We can just say um, that is 7.5. And now if we take this 10 to the minus 3 up there, which is what you have to do when you divide like this, it becomes times 10 to the 3. So your answer will be 7.5 times 10 to the 3 volts, which is equivalent to 7.5 kilo ohms. And that is your resistor value.